the blue. It's right back in the South Point. It's been a while, but it's good to be back. This should be a good one. They're all gonna be good ones, starting at the lightest weight class, moving up to 76. And there's the first whistle, first finals match underway. Golston in the red, Fam in the blue. Golston, the one seed, Fam, little bit of a surprise finalist here. She took out Sage, took out, Caitlin, took out Caitlin, Walker. Caitlin Walker, who had defeated Sage Mortimer, and Golston in on the double leg, finishes quick, and she goes ahead two to nothing, just 20 seconds into this bout. Now she's working for a lace, brings it up, working hard. Good and transition, but they're gonna go back to neutral. Golston has the experience factor here over Fam. Uh, Fam coming out of Wayland Baptist in Texas. Uh, Golston training out of, uh, well, she's sponsored by the uh, New York Athletic Club, trains out of Wisconsin RTC. In her corner, corner is John Reeder, assistant coach for the Badgers. Andrew Cook in the corner for Nina Fan. Nice right side swing single for Golston there. Now she's looking to come up through the middle, kind of isolates both ankles. She needs to turn in hard here, but she's able to get the exposure, so she'll get two more. Fam does counter through, but nothing's offered for her there. So Golston up four to nothing now, minute 45 to go in the first period. Nice crafty finish by Golston. Fam was reaching back, had her hands on those laces. Golston fought through it, got a nice exposure, and then covered, and now it's four to zero early in the first period. I thought they might have gone two for Fam just because she was able to kind of roll through and Golston almost went hand to hand there, but uh, maybe uh, maybe they saw something I didn't see. Yeah, they, uh, I guess, assumed Golston in control the whole time there. Mm -hmm. As she continues her offense. Yeah, she's really getting to that swing single on the right side and she's done a good job of finishing quick. Now Fam still holds that wizard, able to tie her up a little bit. We'll see if Golston can fight through. She's trying to re get that right arm back under her own control. Fam, good job wrestling to get to just the stalemate. That's a victory for her out of that position as Golston was in deep and had finished the last couple of times. Also. Now Fam gets to her offense, little knee pull single. On the left side isolates it, looking to shelf it. Golston doing a good job with the shin whizzer there and whistle blows them back up on their feet. 48 seconds to go, Golston holds the four to nothing lead here in the first period. You see they traded positions there back and forth. Wizard defense in both situations. Golston a little bit more solid there, but they both got the same result back to neutral. Still four to zero with about 30 some seconds left in the first period. Yeah, nice little arm drag there. Almost got to it, seeing Golston switch up her offense a little bit uh, as we've seen her successful with that swing single a couple times. 20 seconds to go now in the first. Ear to ear in the center. Let's see how Fam responds to that. There's a lot of time left, and of course, freestyle. Nobody's uh, that far out of any match. But she's got some ground to make up as the final seconds tick away in the first two periods. And that'll do it for the first period. Aaron Golston in the lead, four to nothing at the break on the back of just two takedowns. It really, you know, pretty action-filled first period uh, despite only the two takedowns. Yeah, I think both these wrestlers are gonna be able to continue this match strong in the second period. Nina Pham was in a wild shootout. Caitlin Walker, we mentioned earlier, um, as her semifinal opponent, that was nine to seven. Uh, so she was able to dig deep and hold off uh, Walker in a very tough semis and Golston as we mentioned has lots of experience she may be uh, a little bit stronger but we'll see what the gas tanks and the stamina levels are here in the second yep and we are back underway second period Aaron Golston in the red Nina Pham in the blue I'd like to see Pham try to get to those legs again Golston uh, very stout defense but Pham got to it the last time couldn't finish let's see if she can keep uh, Golston guessing. There's a Ooh. nice duck under attempt. Good, good change of pace there. Yeah, she did a really good job of changing her levels, changing direction real quick, and almost was able to capitalize on it. Uh, Golston did a good job turning and facing. Yeah, 
that's that's what you want to do. You want to keep your opponent guessing, try a couple different attacks as she goes for a snatch single. That's Bam in there. Pretty deep. She's maybe with her best chance of scoring she's had so far this match. Yeah, real similar to the last time Golson holding that shin wizard and maybe a quick uh, stoppage as she looked like she was still working, but a good, you know, good sign for Fam able to get to the legs again. She's just got to uh, just got to get to her finish here. Two minutes to go now in the match. Both of these wrestlers had already qualified for the World Team Trials Challenge Tournament. That determines the Final X opponents. We have Final X and NYC. We beat the streets. Get your tickets for that. Get your donations in for that wonderful charity. Nice attack oh, really by nice. Golston as she's going to try to put some distance between her and Fam. The other Final X being in Stillwater with Hall of Fame weekend. National Wrestling Hall of Fame, of course, being in Stillwater as well as Oklahoma State University. And that is a big takedown. Six points with 93 seconds left on the clock. That's some distance between mm -hmm. uh, her opponent. Yeah, and Golston's been really su successful with that swing single to the right side. She was almost able to uh, get transition to a trap arm with... Fam's right arm there, but uh, Fam did a good job of defending and holding it just to the two-point takedown. So Fam's been able to get in onto Golston's legs. Has not been able to finish what she got in the final one minute and ten seconds. Goes back to the duck under we saw earlier. Golston turned, was ready for it. Yeah, Fam doing a good job picking up her action here, picking up her attacks. She just has to get to a position where she can convert. It's not like she hasn't been in those spots yet, but converting on the defense of Golston has been another issue for her. And yeah, Golston trying to get a shutout. She's got some match to wrestle still, but she teched her semifinals opponent 10 to 0. Uh, she's been dominant so far today and going to try to close out her weekend in Vegas with a commanding win. She's in good shape right now. 37 seconds to go. Fam coming forward hard. Another duck attempt. Golston doing a good job of squaring up and matching her level. Yeah, now that Golston's fended off, it looks like her two go-to attacks by Fam. She's going to be feeling confident here in these final seconds that she's not going to give up certainly the six points that Fam would need. As we're reaching the conclusion of bout one of a wonderful slate of senior women's freestyle matches here at the U.S. Open. Less than 10 seconds to go now. Fam firing off some attempts. Golston doing a good job. The down block had defense, and that'll do it. Aaron Golston is your winner and U.S. Open champion at 50 kilograms with a six to nothing victory over Nina Pham. Yeah, Nina Pham perhaps a surprise finalist, but she showed she uh, could hang and that she's got a bright future ahead of her. But Aaron Golston getting it done, number one seed. Goes through the whole bracket and gets a well-earned stop sign.